We've already learned that there can be two species that are related by one hydrogen ion, and we call the relationship between these two species a conjugate acid-base pair relationship. We could imagine two species that are conjugate acid-base pairs, and if we have the weak acid component and it reacts with water, we would get an equation such that the equilibrium constant for that would be Ka, or the acid ionization constant. If we take the conjugate base of that species and react the conjugate base with water, we would get an equilibrium equation that would have an equilibrium constant of Kb, or the base ionization constant. Since there's a relationship between the weak acid and the weak base, what would be the relationship between the Ka and the Kb value? What we find is that if we multiply the Ka for the weak acid component of a conjugate acid-base pair multiplied by the Kb value for the weak base component of a conjugate acid-base pair, the Ka times the Kb is equal to Kw. If we look at the p values for the Ka and Kb, in other words, pKa and pKb, we find that the pKa plus the pKb is equal to 14. We could then use these two relationships, either the Ka times the Kb, or the pKa plus the pKb, to find the K values or pK values for whichever of the conjugate acid base pair we do not yet know. In a previous problem, we saw that the Kb for ammonia is 1.8 times 10 to the minus 5. So what would be the Ka for the conjugate acid of ammonia? The first thing you want to do is write the formula for the conjugate acid of ammonia. And we've done this type of problem in other examples previously. So the conjugate acid of ammonia would have one more hydrogen ion than ammonia. So if we add one hydrogen ion to NH3, we would get NH4 plus as a conjugate acid of ammonia. Now, in order to find the Ka for NH4 plus, we need to know the relationship between Ka and Kb for a conjugate acid base pair. We recall that Ka times Kb equals Kw. Since we know the value of Kw, and in this problem we're given the value of Kb, we can use those to find the Ka for NH4+. When we rearrange the equation and we enter the values in our calculator, we find that the value for Ka for NH4+, is 5.6 times 10 to the minus 10.